Hello everyone. Welcome to another exciting episode of RP Quick Bytes. In today's video, we are going to learn about how to create a pivot table in UiPath. For that, first of all, we need to know how we can create an Excel as a manual task. So let's go to Excel. So this is our Excel. I already created that. So in this Excel, you see some data. For this, uh, to create a pivot table, first we need a table. So create this data into a table. So now I am going to convert this data into a table by using Control and T. By pressing this, you see this dialog box and press OK on this. And when you press OK, you see your data is converted into a table. Now, the next task is to create this table into a pivot table. So where we need a pivot table, suppose we need pivot table in this starting from this H column. So for this, uh, go to insert and here you see pivot table. Just click on this and you see this dialog box and here you select the uh, data for which you need to create a pivot table. Okay, when you hit the OK button, you see this and in your right side, you see the topics of, for which you need to create a pivot table. So let me select all these topics. Okay, now you see this table, this data is converted into a pivot table. So this is our manual task. Now we delete this whole things and create this with the help of UI path. Okay, so let me just delete it and convert this table into normal okay save it now we have the data as a fresh data okay so for create this with the help of ui path you need to go to the ui path so here in ui path i already made this bot so let me explain you what the functionality of this bot first thing that we need to create manually in the excel file to create a pivot table we need to create the data into a table so for this we using a create table and one more thing here i need use the excel application scope i use this excel application scope because these two activities create table and create pivot table is only used in this excel application scope they are not working without the excel application scope that's why i'm using this Okay, so here what we need to do, uh, just create a table and in the create table activity, here we need to give the name of the table. So, so here you see the sheet name is item list and similarly the item list name is, I gave it here and the range. Range is means from which range to which range your data is present in your sheet. So here from uh, range of A1 to E6, the data is present so similarly i mentioned it a1 to e6 and now in this uh, second path second column i need to give the name of the table you can give any name according to your convenience so here i name it as a new table and this activity for to create a table of the data that we have okay and the second one is create pivot table now this activity we use to create a table that create above into a pivot table for this we use the same sheet this is the item list and the same table name that we create before so the new table and this is the name of the pivot table that we need to create and this range where i need to put my pivot table so from here this is the h1 column and here i need my pivot table so let me save this and close this okay so now i run the bot okay now bot execution is completed uh, so let me show you that our pivot table is created or not so i have just opened this item list and here you see this table is created and the pivot list of this table is also created okay so this is how we can create a pivot table in ui path so that's all for today's video and please don't hesitate to leave a comment 
and don't forget to like and subscribe our channel for more exciting automation content. That's all for now and see you in next video. Take care. Till then, happy automation.